So today I'm going to show you guys how to factory reset your easy bulbs from TH3D. If you have one of our easy bulbs, they're actually really easy to factory reset even though there's no switches on the device. So I'm going to show you guys the procedure to go through to factory reset the bulbs. So I have an easy bulb here connected to my little testing cord. This is just a simple cord with a switch. The switch you use could be a lamp switch or the light switch in your wall, just something to turn it on and off. So what I'm going to do is turn this on and off six times and leave it on less than 10 seconds every time. If you leave it on longer than 10 seconds, when you turn the switch on, then it's going to screw up the factory reset procedure. So the bulb itself looks for this pattern to determine if it needs to factory reset. On the seventh time, we're gonna leave it on and you'll see that the light does not come back on. And if your bulb was already on, when you started the factory reset procedure, it will not turn on. If it was already off, you won't see any change. So let's go through the procedure right now. So I'm going to go ahead and turn it on and off six times and we're gonna leave it on on the second time. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. And you can see here, the bulb is not turning back on. Now, if I go to my computer after about 30 seconds, you should see the bulb broadcasting its Wi-Fi network again. If you just want to leave it sit here for about 30 seconds, after the 30 seconds has elapsed, you can go ahead and turn the bulb off and you'll know the reset procedure worked because the next time you turn it on, it will be full brightness white. And that's the factory defaults when these come out of the box. At this point, you can add the bulb back to your network as if it was brand new out of the box.